If you want to charge your OnePlus 15, we have a couple of ways that allow you to do so. Essentially, we have two main ways to charge our phone. We have the wired method and the wireless one. And first, we're going to start with the latter, with the wireless chargers. So in this case, in order to start charging your OnePlus 15, if you have a wireless charger, you can just simply place it on top of the wireless charger and it should work just fine. If it doesn't, then of course we can move it up and down a little bit. And if you do this for the first time, you can also open a tutorial that shows you how you should actually line the phone. You can also find the tutorial by going to battery settings. If we go over here and choose charging settings, then here we have the wireless charging tutorial. So essentially you need to place your phone in such a way that the lightning bolt icon is in the center of the charger. So more or less like this. This will definitely help you position your charger in a correct way. And of course, if you don't have a wireless charger at home, but you have any other wireless charger somewhere else, like for example in a car, then it works as well. Now, uh, we have 50 watts of wireless chargers, I mean of wireless charging, so it is a pretty decent uh, speed. It will provide a pretty rapid uh, charging speed. However, it is not as fast, of course, as the wired method. Wired methods are, of course, usually faster. So in this case, we can use a USB cable to connect our phone to anything that provides power. Ideally, you want to use a charger or power adapter, of course, because usually they provide the fastest charging speed. So if you have one, of course, then you can use it that. And uh, well, it actually depends what kind of charger you do have, because of course, chargers now have different technologies and they can provide different um, charging speed and of course they can have different amount of watts. The maximum amount of watts that we can uh, utilize on this phone is 120. Of course if you have faster charger it still works, it still charges the phone, but of course it won't be any faster than a charger that has 120 watts. However, in order to actually use 120 watts we need to have UFCS charger. If you have PPS charger then it will provide only 55 watts at most. PD chargers provide 36 watts and uh, QC chargers also provide 36 watts. So in theory you should have at least 36 watts in order to provide the fastest possible charging speed but of course ideally you want to get 120 watts uh, by using for example the original OnePlus charger. Now if you don't have a wireless charger yet, I mean sorry if you don't have the power adapter yet, um, then of course you can use anything, like I said, uh, that provides uh, power through the USB cable. And this can be anything. It can be your car, it can be your computer, it can be a power bank, anything. Of course the idea of using the cable is quite simple. What you have to do is simply connect the phone to the power adapter or, or charger. So in this case uh, what we're going to do, I'm going to actually connect this to, let me actually get the power adapter. We're going to connect it to the power adapter of course, like this. We connect it to the power and now we can just simply put it into the phone using the USB-C port that we have at the bottom of the phone. And now as you can see we are charging the phone quite easily. And that is pretty much it. So to summarize, you can use anything that you can uh, that provides power by using the USB cable if you don't have the power adapter. But once you get the power adapter, this is the, uh, the usually the fastest way to charge your phone. If you have a wireless charger, you can use that as well. And that is about it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.